Hello and welcome to our video today. My name is Jason of Kageko and Associates. In this video, I will show you how to use our P9 extractor add-in to our payroll template. For you to use this add-in, you have to be a premium subscriber to our payroll template. The template goes for 10,000 Kenya shillings. To use the P9 extractor, you have to have processed your full year payrolls using our Excel payroll template. So let's drive in and see how the template works. So for you to use the P9 extractor, you have to have processed uh, your full year uh, payroll using our Excel payroll template. And uh, you can see a copy of it here. So I'll not concentrate on the payroll because we have another video explaining on how to use uh, the payroll. So I'll just go directly to to the p9 extractor and uh, the first sheet here as you can see is readme where you have the instructions on how to use the extractor and uh, the first thing that you need to do is to fill in the setup page so let's click here and go to the setup page so in the setup page you need to write down the employer's pin uh, the employer's name and the tax deduction here so that has already been done so we continue continue to staff database so here what you need to do you need to go to your payroll and copy the staff database starting from uh, uh, cell a9 uh, going up to the end and downwards so you copy all that information then you paste it once you paste uh, that information there then you go back you go to the months and you paste all the payrolls that you have uh, processed for the particular months uh, in each particular month so let's go and pick uh, january's january payroll so we'll go back to the payroll and uh, the same way we copy all the information from the payroll sorry control shift to the add then down ones copy that then go to the payroll and paste it click yes go to next month do the same thing control v yes go to the next month then do the same thing yes go to the next month do the same thing yes go to the same month yes go to the next month go to the next month do the same thing go to the next month do the same thing up to the month of December so here I'm just using the same copy but um, in a real uh, case scenario you'd be using um, your real um, processed uh, payrolls from uh, what you have saved as a payroll for that particular month but for demonstration purposes I'm just using uh, I'm just using the same uh, payroll to to do that so let's just check whether we have filled each and every month so page up page up page up control page up control page up all the months have been filled so we got back to the readme uh, sheet the readme sheet but then you need to paste a list of your staff from the payroll or the staff database on the first column of the list sheet. Paste the values, the first sense needs to be set A1. So we go to list and then we go back to our payroll, staff database, copy all the staff that we want to make P9s for, control C. Then Alt Tab, then we go back and Control V. So 
uh, everything is set up note this will take some time grab a cup of hot tea i'll take advice and then click on create p9s form for the staff in the list so let's see so it's working and it's creating all the p9s for the staff we had 10 staff and we have already we have already created the um, p9s for all those stuff so let's see uh the p9s how they look like employee 10 that is the p9 employee 9 8 7 employee 6 employee 5 employee 4 employee 3 employee 2 and employee 1 so that is how our p9 extractor works and as i said at the beginning it works with our premium uh, payroll uh, that you need uh, to buy from us at uh, kenya Sh shillings 10,000. if you want to use our free copy it's available on our website we'll paste down the link on the description check out for the link and um, lastly i would request you to subscribe to our videos by clicking the subscribe button and also the bell so that you are notified every time we have a new video so thank you so much again jason of kageko and associates where we are true and fair thank you